Hello, my name is Leo. Welcome to You Don't Know Jack 2015, episode 7. Um, we're pretty much doing one episode an episode. Oh, Leno. This is part of the One Life Under Challenge, although... I mean, I feel like I've already won, but... Why not? We'll just keep going. Listen, don't worry. I find that most people enjoy playing alone. <laughs> and our wrong answer of the game is brought to you by... Hoarder Helpers. Are you a hoarder? We're here to help you hoard more stuff. Absolutely no psychiatrist on staff. Pick the wrong answer associated with our sponsor to win a fabulous prize and big cash. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Once again, I'm taking sips of beer for every last wrong answer, and uh... okay, to get things started, London Bridge is falling down. In the nursery rhyme, Wee Willy Winky, what's covering up Wee Willy Winky's Wee Willy? What? The nightgown he's wearing, the wolf suit he's wearing, the wooden shoe he's sailing in, or nothing, he's completely nude. Nightgown? The first line of the nursery rhyme goes, Wee Willy Winky runs through the town, upstairs and downstairs, in his nightgown. Yay. So yeah, as I was saying, um, I'm drinking, taking sips of beer every time I get a wrong answer. Some and I got my mouse bars too. Showers, and some nursery rhyme guys are growers. And on its way, zombies never get old. What might you see in a television show called The Balking Dead? An army of zombies walking backwards, a horde of zombies walking in circles, a swarm of zombies walking on tiptoe, or a legion of zombies refusing to walk at all. Uh, balking? I have no idea. If the dead are balking, that means they've stopped short or are refusing to move forward for some reason. Yay! Kind of like the plot of so, uh, if I could just go back to that last question about some people are growers and some people are showers. I find it hilarious how women like to compare men's penis sizes when they're flaccid, which means nothing. Four hundred fifty degrees when I'm dead, and we're cooking up a dis or dat. It's all about the. I'm going to read seven items, and for each one, I want you to tell me if it's a type of burial plot available in a cemetery, or if it's. A what? Type of tombstone frozen pizza. What the fuck is the tombstone if frozen pizza? Burial plot. Press the X button. If it's a type of tombstone pizza, press the, the fuck button. is a tombstone pizza? Okay, we're off. <laughs> I have no idea. Maybe it's the scroll. Companion. Family. Oh really? Double top. Half and half. Original. Brick oven style. Cause that's easy. <laughs> All right. Not bad, but not nearly as good as delivery. All right, I'll take a sip for that one wrong answer. Even though my net, I had a net gain there, but. When I die, I want to be cremated, but not just in any oven, in a pizzazz pizza oven. That way, every part of me is cooked evenly. Yeah, and then every, all other pizzas made in that oven can... Ugh, gross. How about... Zack and Miri make a board game? What? What do Seth Rogen and the game Trivial Pursuit have in common? I have no idea. They were both created in the 70s, they were both created by a Jewish woman, they were both created in Canada, or they were both created by accident. <laughs> I feel like this is Seth the... Rogen is no accident. He is the result of years of careful planning by Judd Apatow. Oh. Watch how easy this is. Seth Rogen was born in Vancouver, Canada, and know. Trivial Pursuit was created in Montreal, Canada. Well, I was never gonna get that right, so I guess I'll take a step. Uh, no, that's about it. Yeah. Here 
Here's a good one. Kangaroo. Yeah, come on, kangaroo, 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 kangaroo. Can come on. We had peanut, we had Uranus, we had Amazon. This one has to be kangaroo. It's gotta be a fucking kangaroo. What you get the kangaroo on wrong? Steven Spielberg modeled one third of ET after this subject. Kangaroo, peanut, Albert Einstein, or Uranus? A kangaroo? Really? 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 No! Fuck! It was a peanut. What? Okay, try to drink. What? When kangaroo can't get a bite. Damn, you're really low on the scrolls right now. Okay, how about it? So uh, this is really hard. You can do it, boy. You can do it. <sighs> May I introduce? I've been framed. So I've been looking at this print of the Mona Lisa a lot lately, and people always talk about her little half smile, but I've become obsessed with something else. What the hell is the Mona Lisa looking at? Something to her right, something to her left, something straight ahead, or something behind She's her. She's looking to her left. The Mona Lisa is looking over to her left. Yeah. She's looking at the camera, or the, Which is weird the artist to her left. But my far side calendar. Nobody's found that interesting in years. No, fuck you, far side's also. This far side. Far side was cool. Open wide for... What's black and black and black all over? My wife. If during a battle of wits with the Riddler, <gasps> Batman were unable to solve the riddle of the Sphinx, so. what might the Riddler say to mock him? Huh? Looks like you're not as smart as Oedipus, Bat Breath. You're certainly no Anubis, Bat Brain. You're dumber than Socrates, Bat Bungler. Or even King Arthur figured that one out, Bat Boob. Uh, Socrates. Oh. Why didn't you pick this? In the Greek play Oedipus the King, Oedipus is the only one capable of answering a devious riddle posed by a murderous sphinx. You know the riddle oh, is it Oedipus? Touch when he starts asking huh. riddles anyone could just look up on Wikipedia. She says, follow me down to the sea. Coming up. Oh, I need to drink for you. Yeah. No, I hate these questions. I mean, I hate I hate the mannequin dummy thing worse, but. Right answer here. I'll roll some extra cash your way. Right. Put these bowling pin arrangements in order of most to fewest. Oh my God! Here we go. Seven ten split. Dinner bucket. Christmas tree. Dinner bucket, Christmas for tree, most seven, ten, split, Christmas tree, seven ten split, dinner bucket, Christmas, Christmas tree, tree, dinner, dinner bucket, bucket, seven ten split. Gutter ball. Really? Ready for this? A dinner bucket is when there are four pins left standing. The two, four, five. Christmas tree is just three cards. Christmas cut. tree is three pins left standing. Either the two, seven, and ten, or the three, seven, and ten. Fuck and off. In a seven ten split, there are of course two pins left standing. The seven. Well, we're in real trouble now. All those numbers hurt my brain. Drink, drink again. So I usually let the bowling computer do it for me. I also let the bowling computer do my taxes. I used to say my Christmas tree was... Well, I don't know what I'm talking about. <laughs> Here we Fuck. have... All Men Must Die. Somewhere around episode 9. If the leading cause of death in the Game of Thrones Yay, Game of Thrones question. is the leading cause of death in the modern world, what spoilerish comment would you most likely read on the internet? Huh? Hey, did you know Arya dies of malaria? Jon Snow gets killed in a car crash. Oh. Yeah, Daenerys basically just has a stroke and dies. Uh, or guess what? Tyrion ends up dying of heart disease. Stroke. No, it's malaria. Fuck. What? No. It's malaria, isn't it? The correct answer is... Oh. Killing seven million people. Okay, we're in the negative now. Oh fuck. Death worldwide. 
This is no good. When this is the first time we've been in the negative. I still got, I still got question ten. I still got the the final round, which is the hardest one. But hey, we can do this. Come on, you can do this. Oh fuck me. <laughs> Where to go? Melts in your pretty mouth. Ugh. Gross. Based on the gender roles assigned by the Mars Company, which M&M's character could give birth to an M&M's Oh god, the green one? Red, yellow, blue, or green. For whatever reason, red, yellow, orange, and blue M&M's are male, and brown and green are female. Yeah! Woo! Oh wow, we're back in the positives. Have nuts that confuse me. And I can have one. I want to be in the hospital room when an M and M gives birth. Sure, they melt in your mouth, not in your hands. But I'm telling you, those mini M and Ms are pretty melty when they come out of the birth. Speaking of mouths, look at my mouth's mouth. <laughs> Vane, I'm gonna need a mouth bar to get me psyched up for the jack attack. Brace right. yourself for the attack. When you see two clues that match, yeah, they're kind of melted. It's fine. Two thousand bucks if you're right. Hmm. But you lose two thousand if you're wrong. Oh yeah. Of this combination of coke. Mars bars. It's gotta be a match. Quizzes is really getting to me. Getting mm. the beast of me. What? what animal are you surrounded by? Good luck. Okay. Spider. Spider. No, see, oh god, I'm an idiot. I'm thinking of something else. Yeah, man. Jane Goodall? I'm not here. I'm not here. Oh, is she the character from Tarzan? Pride by the rats. Rats, 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 rats. Wait, maybe dogs. No, it's rats. Uh. Oh, that scares the shit out of me. Timothy Treadwell. Who? I haven't. I have the foggiest idea, man. <laughs> Bees, question mark? I don't fucking know. No, shit, stop, 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 stop! Stop pressing the button, damn it! Fuck, we're in trouble. Who the hell is Melanie Daniels? Oh, fuck. We're in real trouble now. Do not press that fucking button. Do not press that fucking button, I have no idea. And. I have no idea. E what? 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 Oh god, I'm just gonna... No, stop! Stop! Fuck! Oh no! Oh god, I got a really bad feeling about this. Selena Kyle. Who? Who's Selena Kyle? I don't know. I have no idea! It's not dragons. Hey, I got one. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Oh, I'm so scared. I really think I got too many wrong then. Mm. <gasps> oh! Surround themselves with animals are really just lonely. Sure, I myself own two cats, but whenever I see a guy with three cats, I think, oh man, that guy must not have. I'm just gonna finish this bit now. What a total loser. Ugh. Well, well, I guess that's the end of me. I still think I passed. I will, um. I'll leave it up to uh, the the comments to decide whether or not I pass because I beat the um what episode four it was. Um, but uh, that's enough of do you, you don't know Jack 2015. 
But for now, our next week we'll be doing another video in the uh, One Life Other Challenge. But for now, my name is Leo, and I'll see you next time.